Hello friends, welcome to Old Research Channel. Today I am going to explain you and giving you a tips which are 100% profitable and give you correct understanding and will save your life from going into bad conditions. These are all practical experience and reality. I hope this video will be benefited to many peoples. Around 80% of the employees or people who are working are facing these problems. So kindly share these links to as many as people you can. Do not keep it up to you and my request is to you view this video till end. It may take your 15 minutes or what but it will change your life. It will change your life. Please do not ignore it and please share it to the other and ask them to share it to the other also. Credit card reality cases. Counter idea of financial freedom and complete opposite of independence. As soon as you take the credit card, you tie up your legs, you are not going to grow. I am saying you now, you think that it is going because 20% people do the full payment and 80% people go into debt. So this is my video which will explain you how and when what to do and the solution of the credit card cases how to resolve those cases, criminal cases, civil cases also included in this lecture. Please review this video with, I am giving you this in English because those people who are using credit card, they are knowing English very well. So I am not going to, going to give this in Hindi. So that is all. Next, see everywhere there is a trap, trap in the sense when you want to fish a big fish, you will I add one small fish to the hook and later on you will catch a big fish. So they are making 10% cash back, shop now pay later, EMI loan, convert monthly payment to easy installment at the rate less than the 36%. Final stage is that kill, they want to kill you. See how, say one card you have taken fresh card say with 25,000 limit now you are very happy today you are glad okay you start using it go market you are if you have a family then you are then you are in very going to be very 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 long route with the cards because uh, there are something called wants and needs so these there will be more want than less needs so this want and desire will kill you in your life because I am giving you the practical experience. Now first point to be noted never give any blank check to anybody. If he is not giving you loan no problem you will be happy but if you give a blank check means we don't know where you will get stuck. Second, never give security check more than 200,000 dirhams. Why I am saying you, if you have a security check bonds case which is less than 200,000, there is no need for you to go to jail. Whereas, if your check limit is more than 200,000, mandatory you have to be sent to the central jail. You will be sent to the central jail if it is more than 200,000. If it is less than 200,000, you have to pay something and you will be getting uh, a coverage. So now, I will explain the logic of next slide. See the video till the end, I am saying you. So never give a signed check, blank check to any bank. You will be in disaster. Even to your who are very close whatever you are lower or whatever there are cases lower has taken one blank check later on she put one million in her account in his account and try to withdraw she, she filed the case after that few days she was with him and later on she put him into jail by claiming the one million dirham whatever so be careful now control EMI Control your EMI, do not let it control you. How I am saying you, giving you one example. Card EMI monthly income 
you have 25,000 card limit four times your salary it is possible they will give you more four times your salary or card limit then when you start making plan on your card that is the point you are going into their trap how they are bringing you into your trap they will give you shop now pay later plan so you have you saw there is a want not need one laptop maybe a small no now you have budget of 25000 in hand so you will go with high specs so you will go and shop now pay later for 1000 for 5 months no problem i have purchased 5000 dirham laptop so 1000 you have invested in shop now pay later so in every month you have to pay 1000 from your card and your limit has been already reduced from the amount what you have second in the february there will be some other pop up will require so you will say okay no go and make one more shop now pay later so you have done two shop now pay later i am sorry for spelling mistake monthly total you are going to pay 2000 plus minimum charge of the card now as you go on doing this payment you are not making a full payment because now you have gone for the shop now pay later because you are not going to make the full payment and they will charge you the interest so march they will you will see that the amount is going to be more say around 4000 dirhams why because first month shop now pay later second month shop now pay later and the amount which is incurred by the interest that will go and adding it to your card and it you will go bigger surely forget about the real figure but i'm making you that you will have to go to the huge amount then you will get to start you will started getting calls from the bank okay we have option you can make it into equal installment we will give you very less charge we will not charge you 36 percent we will charge you 15 percent 18 percent you can split into five installment you can split into six installment so you will go into the another installment of your monthly so march you have not done any shop now pay later but you have gone into equal installment of your monthly payment for the march so that monthly payments for the march will come into five equal installment or four equal installments say if it is a four thousand say one thousand you will have so on the next month you will have shop now pay later from january from february and from march you have converted that and the interest of the amount which you have utilized full that and it will go become very big amount your salary is say 4000 or 5000 is your salary so they have given you 25000 now at this stage you are having a due of a card 4000 dirhams per month where salary is your 5000 how you are going to pay that minimum payment will be 4000 dirhams this time you will be in very bad condition you will get tortured from many peoples and things they are your mentally you will get disturbed you will put your anxiety in your family kids and office everywhere because you have no money in hand so this is the condition which you will face after few days then okay what are the options you will go to the bank every month as soon as you got salary go and paying paying to the bank paying to the bank now what will happen looking for other sources to make card payments okay card swapping at jewelry shop you will go to jewelry shop they will charge you 25 dirham or something extra on that how much you want okay 4000 then you will withdraw withdraw from here and pay there you pay there and come back and withdraw from here to make your monthly expenditure this game of mouse and cat will go again converting to emi you will get many calls bank will increase your credit limit at this point what bank will do they will increase your credit limit so now you oh at least my credit limit has increased now i can go for something they will say go for credit loan card loan or bank loan so this point you are paying four thousand your salary is 5000 next month is even more and you are going for the loan so what you will think now i will go and take some loan and i will pay the whole credit card but at the end what will happen 
the loan will not give you the benefit the, you will as soon as you take the loan there will be some pop up okay i have to get this also so i will go and capture it grab it now i will pay through the credit card and i will do next month i will settle it this will be the another jump third mistake so these are what i am giving are practically examples and practically cases which people are doing and finally in very bad position if not doing full payment if credit card either by taking a bank loan or selling some asset like gold or land this will be your final stage of the condition when you will go for cards and you are going for buy, taking another card to compensate for the payment of the other card taking loan taking money from here and then then you will become a juggler playing with this card that card that could that card you will get fed up here comes my suggestion 100% solution it might be in next video if but i am continuing it now so do not do anything stop here stop means stop juggling with the card see the solution never sell your home flat car that will be the wrong move stop paying any money to any card payment hard statement do not forget do that stop paying any money to any card payment then what you will do don't get frightened nobody will kill you draw all remaining balance on the card and file a case for settlement from that a money which you will withdraw pay fees to the advocate amount you got from any of this card remaining balance you pay fees to the advocate for filing the case against the card company this is my suggestion and just justice will come either bank will pay you or you may need to pay to bank what does mean this bank will pay you because when you file a case a justice will come up with the arithmetic calculation how much amount you have paid so far to the bank the court will justify it as not with their interest rate as with the central bank policy for the bank means maybe 1% or 2% of the interest so you have taken a card of 25000 and so far you have paid them 35000 dirhams so they have earned from you 10000 more and your card interest was supposed to be 2% or 1% so which will be deducted from that 10000 and suppose you are remaining with 8000 dirhams that will be paid to you by bank because now you are going to make yourself free from this because you will be in the position do or die some people commit suicide also i am telling you straight forward because they got i have seen people coming to me saying suleiman i have no money i am very bad condition i feel like i have to jump from the building i am feeling like i have to cut myself i have to suicide what should i do now don't worry these are the solutions you do that if anybody is facing such kind of problem i have given my email id in my uh, about in my channel you can contact me i will guide you step by step also N see next video or check bonds case and dispute resolve i am not going to the next video i am going to continue the same video so now you have stopped this you are doing do, you are doing this now i will do for a while go home and my download directory and card cases play okay now you have already filed the case it is in the court so till the card case is not solved you are free to go and you are not going to pay to the bank you have to stop paying to the bank now there are other cases 
you have not paid for the bank for six year, six month and you have not filed the case for duration in that case you will become as a defaulter means you are not paying to the bank but if you as soon as you face that you cannot pay to the bank and you go to the co uh, advocate and file the case you are not going to be a defaulter because now you want to resolve the case through justice very hard because bank will not accept your anything only justice go to the court they will finalize what amount you have to pay every month to the bank till that time the card will get settled so instead of paying 4000 per month the justice will give you at least say 500 dirham per month or whatever it is the in your capacity it will never be the more than 15% per, uh, 50% of your salary that is for your consideration i want to make it clear for you so do not afraid of going for the justice do not go for suicide okay credit card cases and their solution so now here you have seen what the solution which i was explaining you there are type three type of cases defaulter criminal and civil now the one you are stuck your debit they have put you into this position and now if you are a defaulter bank will not kill you they will go on accumulating adding adding interest on you if you have left amount in the credit limit so they will manipulate that amount against your dues and keep on piling they will increase the limit of your card also and they will go and put amount from your amount uh, credit and put into your payment also they will do all manipulation all calculation as long as they want so that's why i said drain all the money from the card which was given as a limit because when you are they are going to file the case they will file the case with reference to the limit of the card okay and if you have by chance if you have given a blank check they will put amount x y more than the limit because they will always consider more than the limit so if you are 100 so they will put 400000 required then it will become a big disaster for you so now defaulter and criminal and civil cases so what will happen into defaulter nobody will kill you you will get torture from the bank calling you then if you have given a check for the bank blank check then it will be a disaster but they will put we don't know in the criminal check if you have done a check given a check with wrong signature also you are criminal if you have given check without any amount you will be the bank criminal plus another you are don't know what they will put the value so don't think that i have make a wrong signature on the check it will never get it. you are criminal criminal check bonds case will be filed against you so do not be under impression giving a wrong signature on the blank check will not make you a criminal no it will be against the bonds check second civil after criminal cases are resolved the bank has a duration of one year to resolve the issue if they are resolving that issue and you are paying to them then it will be okay these cases i have seen whenever you go to the bank after being defaulter they will try to trap you they will try to harass you they will say okay sit in this room they will call security 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 and they will play with you like a torturing in such a way that you will do some act which is going against you so they will immediately arrest and send you to the jail because they will make you frustration in such a way that you will beat the security you will beat someone so do not go to the bank to resolve the cases whatever you want to do email that will be the best option or else case into the court to make to protect yourself from different issues for next so if they have a criminal case like suppose you have given a check the check will be deposited and they will file a case for, against you as a criminal case the case will go into the nearby police station which they have that they will call you on your given bank number and you have to attend that and they will ask you you have a case criminal case file against you you have to come and surrender fearfully honest do not play with the law go arrest yourself 
and be prepared with that. When you will go to the jail, you will find many people are inside the jail also. Might be there are many people do their card credit card holder. Out of this many 60 percent, you will find the case of credit card uh, uh, criminals of the credit card. Many cases for the property check bonds. Many cases for the rent check bonds. So these are the different people you will meet inside the jail. In the jail also, they are not going to kill you. Do not get afraid of the jail and getting instead of going to jail, you will jump from the building. Do not do that. Nobody is going to kill you except you. So go and there is a this government is giving you more flexibility to resolve and the things can be done. They are giving you a, a, a security for paying some 20, 10 percent of the amount and it will be given a release for you instead of search warrant and you have a time to negotiate with the bank and resolve it. Bank resolve then bank can file a civil case against you or they can resolve amicably with you try to say you will receive multiple calls from many 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 debit collector companies which bank is assigning I am saying you I will so these companies will call you again and again they will always say you have to pay 10,000 you have to pay if you say I am only having amount of 5,000 as my salary how can I pay 10,000 you have you people have made me into this position so go to the court again we will resolve the case into the court when you will go to the civil case court court will see how much is the case what is the case that predict will be from the court what they decide so do not take any wrong step and whatever i said is very important so when you will have a civil case at that time they may make the assurance that you are not leaving the country when they file the criminal case they go to the emirates bureau credit bureau and they put remark on you that he is a criminal he forget he left the country whatever they want the bank will put that remark if you want to see there is a rolex tower in a sheikh zayed road then go to the 32 floor you have to pay for this investigation by card some other bank card has to be there for payment because you cannot do any cash payment over there that will give you the credit bureau and what remarks they have put for you you can see that also you will require a advocate for civil case or if the case is going into the court when you are getting arrested for the criminal case nobody advocate will help you out for doing anything whatever is going to happen with you it will happen with you inshallah there will not nobody will uh, kill you for that reason they may arrest you they will do whatever the legally what is there but they will not kill you for this crime okay be careful and do not afraid of going and uh, hand overing you so keep that in mind because i have seen many people have done wrong things so now if you want to take help from the other agencies and how they operate debit collection agencies loan and debit rescheduling agencies like a google page i have shown you so you can find uh, any of the agency from this google page because i am not putting anyone's because of the what you say copyright should not be there i am not copying anybody i am just putting a google page and whatever is search page so that is there so you can see and you can meet the advocate and you can pay him the payment may be from between 5000 to 8000 depending on your case by case and next what is there into the advocate also there is something called power of attorney this power of attorney that advocate will make with you i will suggest you whenever you are making any power of attorney be careful because they will say you are granting him all the permission all the acts all the access to the bank so if you are making for any specific bank you assign that bank only not to the all bank okay be careful and not on your property also because he may, when you will be in jail he may have access to your account to finalize or to do settlement for that reason only you give the power of attorney 
So, it's a, you can select advocate who is giving a killer, killer statement about your bank and about your limitation. If somebody wants to make an open power of attorney, he will be cheater. He will engulf your company if you are working in with any company. He will try to, he is advocate, but he will try to use misuse also your power of attorney because he knows that you are already inside. So, be careful. I have seen many cases cases where the whole company was made in, in, into his name. The guy was already into jail. He knows that he will get deported. And later on, he has put again another claim that this guy has taken um, 200,000 from me also. The advocate has put a reverse claim onto the party. This is also there. So, that's why I am making you more clear and precise. That's why I am saying my session is very important before getting into the another traps. Listen carefully. Then, no need for advocate for check bonds cases. There is no, he cannot do anything. In check bonds cases, you will find many people from the bank. There are people who have credit of 100,000. They have buy all the bitcoins from that 100,000 dirhams and now they are going to the jail. But the bitcoin raised by 10 years before or 5 years before, now they are millionaire. Okay? But the case was resolved and case was done that time or it may take three years or four years till that time there will be enough money for him to pay. Okay. Search, okay. Search on Google for check bonds law in your country how to settle these issues. So your country will tell you the laws you have to follow whatever be the procedure. Be kind to yourself. Keep. I will explain you and I am explaining you these now all from the past session how to surrender for the case, how to pay fine, how to get no search letter from the court. After finishing or settling your criminal court check case, you have to go to the court and apply for your no search letter. So, they will issue that no search letter for you. Go and take it and wherever you are traveling, so you have to keep along with you. So, on an airport, they should not ask you or search you because you have a letter of case settlement. So, and how to handle travel ban and other issues. This is the one what I have explained. What is final solution? How long it takes? Because now the one case is settled, other cases are the Now, bank has full authority to file a civil case on you. But bank knows when they give you over credit, when they put additional credit on you, because they know that if they lose this much, they will not get loss. Because you have paid them more than what they spend on you. So, that is the reason they are increasing your credit limits. Why? Because to make you trap even more and you become an earning source for them. So, these banks are money sucking vampires for the card holders. So, be careful and do not be, do not put yourself into this position. Now, no one kill you, accept you. So, do not pay, play blue well game. You might be knowing the blue well game history. Many people, many bank employees, they say, okay, go play blue well game. If you cannot do suicide, it will make you to go into suicide. They will ask you to do that also. There are evidences. They are said that to do. Go play blue well and get rid of it. So, this is the one I am saying and freedom from debt. Now, I have given you the very nice lecture, very nice tips to overcome avoid card that is the first now in this duration i will tell you one more thing if you have amount which is more enough how to settle the remaining case amount you can withdraw suppose 20000 and you can invest into compound interest policies in the sense you invest today, consider that they have caught you and now you paid to the bank some base amount, say 20,000. But your case is not settled. So, to pay that 20,000 for the compound interest policy and every month you try to pay 1,000 because whatever amount you have taken from the bank, you have to pay them. It's, it will be honest. It is not, I am not saying do not pay, pay them. But how you will pay? Now you are in a bad position. So, every month you put 1,000, 1,000 into that. So, after maybe 3 years or 5 years, whatever be the amount, the amount will get 1,40,000. 
in that condition till your case get settlement you will be in position to pay them this is a alternate route or else if you have another thing you can go and buy gold not from the new old where you are selling the gold that shop gives you gold with the current rate there is no making charge so you just every month you go and buy the gold buy gold as much as amount minimum 1000 dirham gold you are buying and saving it as a gold because gold is the asset which can be cashed at any time so you keep today you have 20000 you go and buy gold for 20000 accumulate that gold for 20000 and every month 10000 maybe after 3 years if the case is resolved till that time the cost of the gold will surely get increase and you will have a chance to repay and as a collective money the holding money into the bank will not resolve you or will not give you benefits as this way investing will give you benefit so i have given you alternate options for investing slowly slowly amount little amount preparing for repay this is also well, this is my channel please kindly go and subscribe to my channel and share this video to all other and i hope you will get benefited please share it so the people in need will get real real solutions and description nobody gives you these ideas and these things in detail which i have given you and i hope it will help to all all other my brothers and sisters are also there there are many people who are suffering from these cases so this is my video i'm dedicating to you